<clears throat> Hello everyone and how's it going? Welcome to a brand new stream of Russian Fishing 4. Uh, we're gonna go one hour Sturgy Boys and then we're gonna go to the sea for maybe two hours. Uh, the only issue is I don't know of any spots at the sea. We are gonna try 75 meter hole. I'll do a little bit of research and go on from there. Hope everyone is doing great. Crazy, crazy zebra, hello. I am doing good as well. Thank you for asking, hope. Happy to see you're go doing good. Hopefully the Sturge uh, are good to us today. Got two trophy grailings in the first 30 minutes of Billy. Yeah, damn. That is insane RNG. Wow. Congrats. Damn. Zelucas, hello, Elite, hello, welcome. <clears throat> Man, how much further can I can I go here? There we go. That's the limit. That's the furthest I can go. Uh, did you see the trophy Greenland shark yesterday? Went for seventeen grand. Wow, that was a six hundred something kg. Right during stream, I saw it in the weekly come up here. Uh, you're finally at the sea. I hope you're doing well there. Hope you're making some money. Ooh. <laughs> right off the bat, we have something here. Yes, we do. First fish of the day at the sur Sturge spot is a, a catfish. It's, it's not a Sturge at all. During 9 a.m. Very late cat. Uh, but we will continue. Do you know when will leaderboards reset? Uh, 12, 1, 2, 2 hours and around 40 minutes. 2 hours, 40 minutes maybe, I think. Yeah, I think it's at 2200. My time will be 3 p.m. Leaderboards always reset on a Sunday. The weekly leaderboards, not the all time. My goal is to have the biggest common minnow this week. <laughs> oh, what the heck? What is this? Come on, man. Perch, percussion grenade. Ooh. Wow, okay, we got another fish. Can this be our first Sturgy Boy 
please, please mod. Yay! First Sturgy Boy. Like, we've been here, what, one minute? 10 kg, I'm hoping this is. Eleven point eight kg, very nice. <clears throat> uh, come on, Sturge boys. Yes, please give me Sturge. Mulled wine. Ooh. Thank you so much. Oh, I'll get a trophy. <laughs> I uh, I hope RNG is listening and RNG gives us a trophy. Thank you. Because I really want to like full lock and be aggressive. Uh, but the issue is our mech is just trashed. 20% mech damage. And this one is 8.4%. So if we're going to get a trophy or a big sturge, it needs to be on our middle rod. Because uh, when you full lock, that goes on your mech and not your friction break. At 29 friction break and below, it's friction break. That's working. When you full lock, it's on mech. Thank you, thank you. Oh, yes. I like this. Come on, Golaf. You can do it, Golaf. I can walk back if I wanted to, but it's, it's small, so... I ain't worried. 17 kg Rusky. What a amazing start. Four minutes in. Middle rod had something. Tiny little fish. What is this? It's a 3.4 kg Sturgy Boy. If it is small, I want it to be a Sturlet. Because obviously Sturlets, Sturlets are small and, you know, they're, they're good money. So... <laughs> yeah, the Golaf is huge. It's it's mega. <clears throat> Look at that. Two minutes, 11, 17, 3. I think the 17 kg is 100 silver. So that is super awesome sauce. <laughs> yes, Mr. Krabs. Um, <clears throat> all about the money. Money, money, money. Atrio, hi. Uh, no, I don't have a PVA on the Golaf. I only put PVA on the first two rods. Even at Amber, that's what I do. Uh, but thank you for letting me know. And welcome, welcome to the stream. Man, no one's really been to the sea. There's not much going on on uh, VK about the sea. So that's concerning. 
Um, so from what I've heard, people usually just put PV on two rods. Uh, and maybe a long time ago, I've tried it on three rods and I didn't notice a difference. So since then, uh, amber and any other fishing, I just used two. But since sturgies are very slow, I feel like three would be better. But... <clears throat> I've never put three. At least with Amber, like I haven't noticed a difference. Yeah. Yes, I will be going to the sea today. I'm thinking of doing a sturge fishing for one hour and then go to the sea for two hours and see how it goes. The only issue is for the sea, I really don't know what's working and what's not. Uh, but we can go to the 75 meter hole and... <clears throat> Uh, we can use the hunter and uh, floral pilk or whatever. Quagga, hi. Uh, how is Amber? Is it good for grinding now? I mean, I made... Uh, we were at Amber yesterday. That's where I started the stream. What the heck, really? That's where I started the stream. We made, uh, uh, um, how much was it? I got a trophy in an hour and we made decent money there at the 83 meter spot. So yeah, yeah, it's decent. It's not amazing, but it is decent. Uh, you're at the 34 and it's doing okay. Are you using like foam or rubber or, but. Okay does not sound good to me. <laughs> uh, this dirge I want to chop up. Let's falsely padding our... Our fishnet hair. All kinds of gummies. Ah. Wait, your high skill level? What? I can try this combo again at the 75 and see if it works. And then we can try the Hunter 300, uh, one or two, I'm not sure. I think one we can try again at the 75 meter hole. Damn, no molds at all.
Lucas. Hey, how's it going? Welcome. <clears throat> how's it going for you? How's RF4? How's life? I'm doing good as well. I am doing good as well. Just uh, waiting for Sturgy Boys here. Ooh, thank you so much for the crickets. I really appreciate it. YT, hi, welcome. Uh, we got a quick, within two minutes, we got a few quick Sturgy Boys. That's That was really nice when we arrived here. Uh, so now we're just waiting. Hopefully early evening we got more. Uh, if you have been to the sea today or yesterday, any any tips? Like, you know, I'm thinking of using Floropilf 235 or the Hunter 300 at a 75 meter hole. Hope that works. Uh, it is 21 meter clip casting east. Here. So basically towards that log. Ooh, you've been messing with shads. Ooh. Okay, okay. I have monster shad, I have... Which, oh, oh, this one. <laughs> Thank you. So, I mean, I guess we can try that with uh, at the 75 meter hole. Which one should I use? A dot? Whoops, that's not the one. The shads only take up to four odd, I think, or six odd. Let me have a look here. This is the one you. S uh, they can go up to six odd. Uh, six odd. Here we go. And then one twenty zero nine. Oh, one twenty zero nine. Yes. Thank you so much. Uh. We're at the unmarked pit at F5. Let me write this down. Unmarked pit F5. Did you see the post about a guy with 40% marine level getting a blue ling trophy? I don't know if it was a ling or blue ling trophy, but man, that is some <laughs> good RNG. I mean, I got the black buffalo when the sea came out, so... <laughs> Thank you, Gus. All right. Obviously, like, I'm not going to be doing as good as you are uh, because I don't have the rest of the gummy bears. Uh, but yeah, I'll, I'm willing to try this. Sounds fun. Makes you sick. Uh, it's been such a struggle because, you know, I like I was telling everyone. If you want to level up your bottom feeding, your bottom fishing, you know, you you go cruising and gibble to catch hundreds of them, you level up. Spin fishing, you go trolling, doesn't matter, you catch trash fish, whatever, who cares, right? At least you're catching a lot. But with the sea, it's not possible for me. Like, I've never been able to just catch fish after fish after fish. It's very hit and miss. I bought this West Coast 
uh, rig two in so I can use you know flying collar uh, not flying collar pitter noster and like I can put shrimps on this but like it's only worked a few times for me so I just gave up on it sardines and blue weddings uh, yeah, I saw someone's post at the 34 meter hole Oh, Gus. I have a video coming out tomorrow of a fishing game. And I played uh, 9, 10, 11, 12. Over three hours of it today and like maybe two hours yesterday. And I cannot get enough of that game. And I really want to stream it with Gus and everyone else here. Like we can all hop on the same server. It's so much fun. I'm not going to... I'm not going to say what game it is or or where it's at, but <laughs> when it comes out tomorrow, <laughs> oh, but I can't get enough of that game. Once I'm finished streaming this game, I'm going to go to that game. Aris, hi. I'm doing good. How about you, Impulsive? Hi. Welcome, welcome. I'll send you a message. I just want it to be a surprise for everyone else. <laughs> it's so much fun because... It's a, like, it's a social game. The most fun you're going to have is when you're all hanging out. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. 80 meter, 20 meter clip. Ooh. Thank you, thank you, Gus. I'm going to write this down. Uh, Giant Chad I-33 series is very nice at any hole. What? Oh, I don't have those, do I? All right, I'm going to write this down. 80 meter, 20 meter clip. Pink, green. Pink, green. Shrimp? I don't know what the heck a Dino Mac is. Oh, shrimps for... Oh, mackerels and blue whitings. Okay, 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 okay. I see, I see. Thank you, Gus. <clears throat> I'm definitely going to do that. I need I need the skills. Look at this. 67.6%. Pathetic. I would buy premium if I played this game every day. And I just... The only time I play this game is when I stream, which is pretty sad. And I also have four points at the moment, but like there's nothing to put them in. Gummy Mac, medium rod is where I'll have to put all the points. Yeah, exactly, right? Because once you put the points in, you can't undo. You only have one undo button, and that's it. So I ain't messing around. Ooh. Here we go. 17 kg. Man, I love eating these things out. 13 kg, not bad. Man, that's so much XP, 22. Nice. What are you fishing for right now, Gus? You have 10 points sitting around. Damn. Yeah. <clears throat> You're trying to close the turbot. Ooh. Okay, we, we gotta walk back on this. The only way out is to be super aggressive, I would say. But also, I can snap my line really easily here. Uh, it doesn't look too strong. Oh yes, baby. Get wrecked. 
finally I can use the Venger. Oh, oh, no, 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 don't go down. I love it when I can full lock the Venger and use it fully. 26 kg, hot damn. Today's our day. Gus is here, so we have that Irish charm going for us. <laughs> oh man. 3.3. 3. 3. Oh, it's a punk to find, yeah, those turbos. You leave my luggage in there. <laughs> you have infinite, infinite amount. Come on, can't you, can't you spare a little bit, please? Okay, okay, I, I like this. Uh, check your Discord message whenever you get the time. Hey, finally, mole, 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 mole. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Uh, ooh, have you checked out Professional Fishing 2? I guess not, because... Anytime throughout the day I check Discord and, you're, and it says you're playing RF4. You play RF4 all day, every day. Uh. They're after being lucky charms. So, Professional Fishing 2 is coming out in September. Starfield is coming out in September. City Skyline 2 is coming out in October. Man, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to be streaming because it is a tight schedule. Tight. And then next year, the Star Wars open world game is coming out. I can't wait for that either. Man, I haven't been this excited for video games in so many years. And it all started with Hogwarts Legacy. That was one game I was really looking forward to. I know, I've said it plenty of times, I haven't played that game since I last streamed it, which is sad. But, you know, when you gotta work like a dog to make money to make a living for the rest of your life, it's, it's pretty, pretty sad. I wish I was rich. You know? Not too much to ask, is it? Oh, come on, bro. You're so close to being a marker. Oh, come on. Hey, it's a trophy at least. I mean, if I'm gonna get a purge, might as well it be a, a trophy and earn, uh, what, 20 silver? <laughs> hey. <laughs> Hello, sticks. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I think that's all sticks. Sticks came and boom, we got a trophy. Uh, you loved Hogwarts, but to be fair, once you complete the main story, uh, there, there wasn't much appealing. Bro, I didn't even finish the main story. I wish I had more time. But yeah. Ooh, I bought a one terabyte SSD, the NVE, that goes right into your motherboard. Uh, I bought that, it's coming tomorrow. 
and I bought it only for Starfield. I don't even need a one terabyte SSD because I have two terabyte S uh, hard drive. I have two SSDs that I have my other drives on, but they're too small. Starfield requires 120 gigabytes of SSD, and I don't have that much space. So, <sighs> yeah, kind of, kind of serious. But having an SSD is going to make it easier for streaming quality um, and open world games. It's going to help a lot uh, because I was just reading a little bit on people's comments in open world games. So as such as Hogwarts, you need VRAM, uh, but our video cards don't have enough of it. You know, only like the top tier video cards have enough VRAM uh, to play these very unoptimized open world games so when you don't have enough vram you need a ram so if you have 16 32 gigabytes of ram minimum that then carries the weight and when your ram is full <coughs> it's being used then your ssd or your hard drive gets used so if you have an ssd then that carries the weight so yeah I have 16 gigs of RAM. I, I'll finally have an SSD that should help with rendering videos, uh, playing open world games, and hopefully with streaming as well. I just got a gigabyte internet, so my upload speed is 1,500 megabytes per second. Uh, so I can stream in 4K if I want to, but I think my video card or processor, whichever one is being used, is going to just fry. Uh, you have a 32 gig and a 1 terabyte onboard SSD. Perfect. You are ready for Starfield. If that is even something you want to play or you're interested in. I bet you this trophy is going to kill the spot and we're not going to catch anything again. It looks interesting to be fair. Yeah, I just hope it's not shallow and stupidly broken. Oh, oh damn. I'm being stupidly aggressive when I don't even know what the strength of this fish is. But I loved Oblivion so much. Even though it was such a buggy mess in the beginning, I just had an amazing time with it. So, oh damn. Ah uh, boy, okay, I need to be careful here. There we go, it is out of the water. Ugh. Man, I'm being way too reckless. Twenty eight KG Rusky. Damn, I haven't done this good in Russian fishing in forever. In like two years or something. Yeah, my only grip about that game is that if you bought their founder edition or whatever the hell it is, which is like a hundred bucks, uh you can get early access, uh which is a beta access, uh which happens five days early. So all the big shot streamers and stuff, they're all going to stream on that day. And I'm not spending 100 bucks to play a beta that's filled with bugs. So I'm going to lose out. Uh, I did sign up for it on Key Mailer to be, you know, like a... Uh, to make coverage on the game. But I don't think I'm going to get it. Since it's such a huge game, it's probably like the biggest game of the year. They're only going to give it to big time streamers and YouTubers.
I'm really happy with what we have right now. We're making some good money here. Wow, look at that. No winds at all tomorrow. Perfect. Next three days is really good weather. I'm happy with that. So half hour left and then we will go to the sea. I want to spend a full hour here. Nether, hello, welcome. No idea what you're saying. Look at that, only our middle rod is getting hit. And I'm happy for that because it's the least busted up. Aw, another non marker. That's our third non marker sturge. Oh, this guy's non marker too. Welcome everyone, welcome to the stream. Going after Sturgy Boys, GD Gaming, hi, welcome. Hey Nether, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome, welcome. Gus, yes, Gus is here as well. And Sticks. And many other people. Or some other. Not a whole lot. So 37 grand guys 43 grand is our goal our aim so we can get the Tiaga and then I want to go for catfish because catfish are active right now and it it pains me uh, but I'm not gonna fish for it with Aventure that's just I mean the sea has made me sick and tired <laughs> I'm going after these fish with the venture. Uh, so once we get the Tiaga, we can finally go to the sea and not struggle as much, even though our rod is still going to be 68 kg. But when we go for cats, we can use a 100 kg rod. And man, that's going to feel so good. So good! Thank you, thank you. Uh, what am I catching? I am going after Russian sturgeons right now. We're going to spend an hour here. It's been 37 minutes. 
and then I'm going to go to the sea and try to just make money and scale the level there. Seems to me that in this game you need to scream or day in order to achieve something. Oh, you're using Google Translate. Oh man. Thank you. I'm trying. So it's a free to play game, which means it's very, very, very grindy. So you're gonna have to spend hundreds, thousands of hours to get the good stuff. Like I have, you know, two thousand seven hours now. That's how I have, you know, two Venjas, Golov, TI Rods, and stuff. Uh, what is my skill level? 67.6%. Uh, That's all I have. And I need 75 in order to actually like start doing decent on this map, on the C map. So, medium bolt rod, 75%. Got a fish. Okay. Now the mech on this is trashed. It's twenty percent damaged, so if I max line it, I think I'm gonna break my reel before I break anything else. Actually, no, I'm gonna snap my line because 100 kg minus <gasps> 20 kg is 80 kg. The line is 74, so we should be good. Oh, it's a stupid cat. Yeah, at least we got it out the water, so I'm happy. All right, phew. No. Damn it, where are you going? Thirty seven kg catfish, bro. Yeeting it out like hot damn. 
Look at this, 20% mech damage. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's Gucci. Man, we're doing so good today. Yeah, this marine skills just been a pain for me. Uh, T, let's put this. Hello, evening, Rasmus. How's it going? Welcome. Ancient shores. Okay, okay. We're making we're making decent money today. I'm I'm happy with this. Uh, back to work tomorrow. I have been free for four weeks. Ooh. Yeah, after four weeks, that's going to be tough. That's going to be tough. <laughs> but I wish you a smooth return back to work. And uh, yeah, it's not much I can say. You're happy to be working again? <laughs> Gonna miss uh, hanging out with your son all day every day. Oh man, that's sweet. Well, I hope you guys had an amazing time bonding together and uh, yeah, with work it'll be a bit less, but that's just life. Uh, you're going fishing in real life tomorrow on a Monday. Oh yeah, you're off of school, right? That's why. Best time ever. That's great. Yeah, I know, I know. I was like, don't you have work? But then I'm like, hold on. You're just off of school. You don't have work. So you can go whenever the heck you want. <laughs> Man, if I had two months, uh, or yeah, two months of vacation, paid vacation, oof. I would be waking up at like, I think once, maybe twice a week, I'd schedule myself. Uh, waking up at like 4 a.m. and going fishing twice a week every week for two months that's what I do and then the other days I'd still be waking up at like 8 a.m. or 7 a.m. and just you know re like recording streaming and then later on I don't know doing RRL things just going out hiking or something it'd be so much fun man or I'll just be a couch potato and just gain weight and just eat everything and yeah, <laughs> that's also a real possibility. You have five weeks of paid vacation. Yeah, see North America. Oof. Uh, here in Canada, I only have two weeks of paid vacation and three paid sick days. 
uh, it also depends on your company uh, really good companies you know they have three to six weeks of paid vacation but that's higher level positions um, in my company I need to work for five years before I get three weeks of paid vacation But I know in Europe, like you, could, I don't know, in some countries, there's like two months of paid vacation or something. It's insane. <laughs> in U.S., oh man, U.S. has no paid vacations. It is sad. Even their maternity leave, like once you give birth, you you only get like three days of paid vacation. That's it. Then you need to return. It is brutal in the U.S. So you got one week left. You also have something we call the Papa Papa Dagar. Uh, something like Father's Day. Ah, when you have kids. So I have 210 days with 90% of my salary without working. <laughs> oh my god. Gotta give my girlfriend all days so I could have only 90. Yeah, that's really good. Because I know here, like paternity leave. Uh, you get, what do you get? You get nine months. I think you get nine months of paid like paternity leave when, uh, when you have a child and you can share it. So, you know, like the mother can give the husband three months of vacation or however you want to do it. But that's amazing. That's really good. Uh, how long have we been here? We have 10 minutes left before we leave. But man, look at this. 37, 28, 26, 17. I've never done this good sturge fishing here in October. And so you don't even got 420 days. I think it's shared between. But the dad must have 90 of them. <laughs> man, that's amazing. I mean, three months is pretty amazing compared to zero. You know, the wife's like, yo, I am taking all these days. <laughs> and then you have zero, so. Met in three months hanging out with the kids every single second. You're not even going <laughs> to... <laughs> once once your leave starts within this like within the first week you're gonna be like bro mm, i want to go back to work you can have the other two months please <laughs> oh man Oh man, yeah, I'm only planning to do two hours at the sea and that's going to be it. Uh, one hour we're going to spend at an unmarked pit uh, that got suggested. And then we're going to use our shrimps at the 80 meter hole the next hour. So I think it's going to be exciting. It's going to be something different going to 
Oh. Right as I dig. It's okay, it's a small boy. Oh, thank you so much, Gus. Gus, Gus is amazing. <laughs> Another cat. 11 kg cat. Oh man. Oh. <laughs> Listen, I mentioned it earlier on stream. I am not going to go for cats until I get the Tiaga. Because I'm very sure you know, every time we go to the sea, you know, we're hooked on to a halibut and it takes forever to reel in any big fish. And it's just, it's so annoying now. I can't take it anymore. Uh, that's why I'm not touching cats until I get a Tiaga. Slap that on our 100 kg barracuda and I cannot wait to go catfishing then. I'm gonna see the difference. So we're at 37.7k. Uh, I believe Tiago is 43k. So it's it's a little bit more before we have it. Jacqueline, hi, welcome to the stream. What's up, what's up? Come on, you can't just nibble and then leave. Hola. Oh, we got five minutes left. Come on, give me something here. Oh, come on, bro. Right as I dig. Huh, nothing. Is the fish taking it in now? Okay, it's small. It's not bad. Seven kg. Cola, cola, cola.
Oh yes, uh, we can prepare a coast one too. Uh, pink and green shrimp. Uh, three yacht. Pink and green shrimp. Oh, I don't have either. Okay, we can buy new shrimps. Pink and green shrimps. Okay. When we go there, we will buy them. Now, guys, should I just go straight to the sea and sell these fishies there? Or should I restart the game and go to a tube? Because I doubt there's going to be a cafe order for any of this. Go see. Okay. Ooh, beta larva. That score right there. That's what I wanted. And well, the mole cricket, but that's great. I like it. Alright, how are we doing here? One more minute. <laughs> yeah, I got a trophy purge. <laughs> yeah, this is really good haul. We are way more than 400. Yesterday we made 400 silver and our biggest was like a 20 kg and we had around this many fish. Majority of them were like 5, 6 kg, so. Uh, 15 minutes, 10 fish. Nice. Thank you so much, Gus. You are awesome. <laughs> a trophy perch, I guess. All right, let's go to the sea here. You got your first blue link. Congrats! <laughs> Yay, blue link. I don't have one, but Sea worm, yay. All right, one hour of Russian sturgeon fishing. Let's go by price. 787 silver in one hour. Hot damn. That is some insane fishing. 28 kg, 167 silver, 26 kg for 156, 17, 100 silver, 37 kg cat, 96 silver. Wowzers, this perch, 28 silver. That's the best I think I've ever done uh, with Russian sturgeon fishing. Wowzers. Like, subscribe, comment. All right, perfect. That's done. Uh, Gus, once more, once again, thank you so much. Uh, 126 odd hook. Shock leader. Okay, that's where you are. Yeah, I don't have your setup, but hopefully that'll, that'll get me stuff. Uh, before I do, however, I need to buy the pink and green shrimps. Thank you, thank you. Uh, where's my goal off? Put that there. Coast run is on the second one. Sixty six hundred sixty. Okay. Shrimp eight gram. We need one, two, three, and green one, two, three. So
we can put two pink and one green. There we go. Nice. Perfect. All right, we're going to do that second. First, we're going to go to this 80 meter. Uh, no, this uh, F5. Let me just look at this. Yep, in that one, in this place. Okay. 52 kg. Greenland shark, very nice. Uh, to our rental. To our rental. All right, we got to go all the way here. And then we are going to go to 80 meter hole. Where is 80 meter? Oh, it's all the way here. 20 meter clip. Oh yeah, that's where I farmed before. Long time ago. All right, see, don't let me down today. Damn, 9.6 kg blue ling, nice. Oh, 55 meter depth, okay. You're not setting a clip, you're it's just depth. Christian, hi, welcome, Venomous Jack, hi, what's up, what's up, Jack, thank you so much for helping me out with uh, professional fishing too, uh, but I saw another person post about the spots on the Discord form, uh, which is similar to what you were talking about, so I'm gonna try that maybe tomorrow or something. Kane, hello, rheumatic, hello, hi guys, welcome to the stream. Uh, let's hope we can do good and crank some uh, money and uh, experience out from the sea. I restarted playing this game. Nice. Are you enjoying it? Man, I enjoyed full locking those sturge and yeeting them out. That's one of the best feelings in the game. You know you've made it to the big leagues, you know, to the end game when, when you can do that. That's why I only, when I go sturge fishing, I only go after East Siberians because every time I've tried Russian sturgeon fishing, they're always small and it's just, yeah. I didn't care for the game because of the pricing. Yeah, it's free to play, so it's very extremely grindy and that throws a lot of people off. Logging 245kg Greenland with the Tiaga. <sighs> Look, I'll get there someday, okay? <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, that must feel real good. 245 kg. Man. <laughs> you mostly play Fishing Planet? Ah. You're more into the arcade type. Yeah, G GD Gaming is heavy into Fishing Planet as well. <laughs> I mean... It is, though. There is no fish fighting mechanism in that game. It doesn't matter what you do once you hook on to the fish. Once the fish is hooked on, it's on a timer. It doesn't matter what you do. It will always come in at the time it's supposed to come in. And that really kills the fun for me. Once I catch all those, you know, most or all the fish species on a map, it's just... It's boring for me then, after that, because I've experienced everything. Uh, not RF4. And Fisher Online. Both of these games have actual fish fighting mechanism, where fish have stamina. And your gear makes a difference on how you, like, how quickly you tire the fish out. I believe Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2 has fish stamina as well, they've mentioned, but... Um, I think their stamina system's all broken, still, so... I'm on Fiji. It is around noon time, so show my setup. <laughs> What's there to show? This is this is it. This is all I have. Ooh. Yeah, like I said, I'm low skill level, so I don't have... No, I'm at the 55 you mentioned. And then besides that, you mentioned go to the 80 meter with the 20 meter clip with the shrimps. I'm going to do that after the spot. Can you go for tuna? I wish I could, but there isn't a spot for tuna. Yo, what is this? Is this a cusk? Fish of stamina and fishing planet depends on the right setup you use. I still... Ooh, 8 kg, not bad. I still question that. Um, I remember a long time ago searching up and I never found anything about fish stamina or Yeah, F5 <laughs> Thank you, but I've never oh yeah, I've only got one tuna and that was obviously complete RNG
I guess you do with 5k hours. Yeah, I heard. I heard they have marine fish coming and I think it's only in the marine map there. There's a fish fighting mech or something like that. Or is it in the entire game? That they're implementing it. That's you. <laughs> Thanks. I missed any tips on getting from 91 to 100% bottom skill. So, um, how I got to 100% uh, bottom skill is I went to Mosquito. And you go to the dock. There's a small dock or a pier. And you cast right by these green lily pads. It's like literally less, maybe a five meter cl uh, clip or less. And you put the smallest hook you have and any garbage bait you have, you know, dough ball, uh, dough ball, yeah, cottages, anything, any garbage thing you have and just throw it. All three rods. And you will catch fish after fish after fish after fish after fish. And that's the only way to level up your skill. It's not catching trophies. It's not catching. It's not about catching rare fish. It's about catching as many fish as quickly as you can. It's entire game. Okay. Um, do you guys is, have they announced when it's going to be out for Fishing Planet? Because now I'm interested. Uh, but in this game, the fish don't have stamina. They'll just keep fighting infinite time if you don't put enough drag on them. Only players don't like the system at all. So for the answer, don't use light setup. Problem solved. You have 111 fish at the sea. Bad thing about Fishing Planet, you have to be a premium player to get anywhere in the game. Uh, I played other games. Find out we're all the same. Yeah, so... I couldn't continue playing Fishing Planet because uh, like I only got one or two hours on the weekend to play, right? And it's just the way uh, their rental and license system is, it's terrible. So I was never, I was barely making any profit at all. Fighting 1.8 kg. This is definitely slow, but Let's turn around a little bit, go in the three hours, 1.4K. Not bad at all. It's very, it's good. Fisher Online, yes. Fisher Online's great. Welcome everyone to the stream. Hope you're having an amazing time. Please hit that like button, support the stream. Please subscribe. Help us achieve our monthly goal. Before traveling to 80 meter, try 75, clip 20 with shrimps. Okay, thank you guys. Try 75. Okay, that's close by. I'm thinking of going there now because uh, I don't know if this... You know what? Four minutes, three fish. Let me stick around for a little bit more and see. We're going to buy a halibut set. Yeah, 75 is close by. We can try that. Key do key.
Need 2k more. It's 3 hours. Not bad. Oh, it's a trashy cod. No, it's a sate. No, it's a cod. Damn it. Worthless. <sighs> Man, they nerfed the cods to the ground. So hard. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. I might as well convert that sate. Yeah, it's too slow. Alright, let's take out this bad boy. 20 meter clip. This is a 78 kg rod. Alright, hopefully this is activated. We can catch loads of fish. Man, guess I can't I just... I can't get that game out of my mind. <laughs> I can't wait to play that game again. Uh, but the video on that game is releasing tomorrow. For everyone wondering what I'm talking about. A boot. And you know what? I can't wait for Professional Fishing 2 to release because that is a game where all of us can hang out and see each other in game and uh, fish together. So I think that'll be a really great community event. Because uh, I remember with Professional Fishing 1, we should we did that. Tom, hi, welcome. Welcome to the stream. You should join us. One night for Battle Bit. What is battle bit? Let me Google that. Battle bit. Ooh. Very positive. Oh, this game just came out. Battle bit remastered. Looks interesting. Supporting 200 players per server? <gasps> Is this like a huge, you know, like a 100 versus 100 player game? Oh, wait, I'm supposed to very slowly retrieve this, like uh, 13. Oh, whoops, that's, that's the friction break. No, there we go. Yo, that legit sounds like fun. <laughs> I'm all for it. Tom, hello. Hi, if I haven't said it, it already. Uh, right now, I am assuming you know what game I'm playing. Um, but the game I'm referring to, I'm not going to mention it. I just want it to be a surprise to people. And the video is releasing tomorrow. 
So keep an eye on, on, on about it tomorrow. Yeah, maybe maybe this Friday after work if I am free. I'll I'll check it out. There we go, finally. Okay, okay. Blue whiting, very nice. Welcome everyone. Hope everyone's doing good. Hope your weekend's been going great, guys. Nice. Nice. There we go. Oh my god, please. For the next two hours, get me a fish every cast. European Angler 10kg. Nice. Impulsive. Can you play this game on Xbox? No, sir. This is only for PC. DT Gaming. Hi. Has fishing. Uh, tuba was amazing. We did the best ever. Uh, and now we're at the sea. And we're just figuring things out here. I'm thinking of getting a battle bit as well. Looks a lot of fun. Man, Bavanook. The, the battle bit sounds like it's right up uh, Bavanook's alley. He would have loved it. I remember streaming one of, I think it was what, World War Three. When I was in beta, I, I, uh, I played that game with him. And when the full version was going to release, I told him that, you know, with Gus and Mescutus will stream that game together. But... <sighs> Bavi just uh, got busy IRL. I guess. I think 20 meter clip is a little too short. Welcome back. Two minutes, three fish. We're pickling. Okay. Thank you guys for walking me through this. Uh, fishing planet, you can fish with your friends too, just like professional fishing. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I remember in 2020 um, when I started pr uh, fishing planet for the first time. Many members of the community, we all uh, joined together and fished together. It was a lot of fun. Can you really perk with a paternoster? I don't think so. It's the drop and raise motion that gets the fish. So that's what I'm going to do. Can't find myself going back to our fortress yesterday and just went back off the game, the whole mess. Yeah. You and cats are lit, damn. That sucks, man. Uh, you're using marine lure jigging rig. Huh? Oh, that's slightly different than what I have. Okay, okay, I see. This is the only thing I can use. I was in fishing for and fisher online and other games. Make you feel like you're the last man on earth. Yeah. 
See, Fisher Online is so amazing in its level design. It is just insane. That guy knows how to make level design uh, because you truly feel like you are out in nature alone in the wilderness. Uh, whereas in RF4, like you're by yourself, but it's just, it's bland and it's, it's just low quality, unfortunately. Whereas for sure online, it's just so lush and you know, like I've said it before, but like whenever I record a video for Fisher Online, I take screenshots, you know, to use as thumbnail. And I have so many beautiful screenshots of every map that I have a hard time deciding which one should I make into a thumbnail. Whereas with RF4, it's like I take screenshots and none of them look good because like, look at this, just water, sky and gray mountain Ooh, mackerel The rod layout, yeah That sucks, uh, DT It's unfortunate to hear that Hey, yeah. Eight forty four gram. Uh, six minutes, one, two, three, four markers, and I think one or two non markers. You don't use sonar or fish finders. In RF four, because they don't work. You know what? I kind of really want to keep the non markers so we can. So we can gauge on how many fish we're catching per per minute or per hour. But I've already thrown away like four non-markers, so <laughs> it's too late. But at the 75, uh, we can also try like our, you know, pilker or something, heavier setup. And we got to move again because we're right at the corner. That has a shimmer, nice. I don't I don't know if I remember seeing it, but when the fish are in the water in that game, in Fisher Online, and you're pulling them in, they look absolutely amazing. Once you pull them out, they just look disgusting. <laughs> Ah, uh, you don't use fish finders IRL. Okay, I see, I see. Still waiting to level up here.
Rasmus, where are you fishing at the sea? Can I make this into... Oh, it needs to be a marker, doesn't it? That's crap. What the heck? Why can't I make non-marker into fillets? That's stupid. You can connect devices to your phone. That's pretty cool. It's too bad they're very expensive. On the Ocean Queen, should we try this at the 75? Or should I try like a Hunter or a Floropilk? 750, look at that, this is great. Romario, hi, welcome, welcome to the stream. We are almost at 20 likes, thank you so much for all the likes, you guys are amazing. Hit that subscribe as well. I'd like to see a fishing game that has bow fishing. Yeah, it is a big thing in southern US. Uh, but bow fishing sounds really complicated to make. Like proper, proper bow fishing. Uh, what hole are you at? That's some awesome bite rate. Uh, I'm at the 75 using this stuff. So I'm getting tiny fish here and that's what I want. Oh, DT. That's too bad. You got 1.5% to go for droppers. So close. What the heck are droppers? Ah, drop shot. 75%? Is that what you're talking about? A boot? Can't wait for mediums. Medium boat rod. Guys, thank you so much for all your help and for hanging out with us. All the best to you and uh, your stream. And hope to see you soon. Thank you, Gus. Bye. Gus also streams RF4 and other games on Twitch. If anyone else is interested in uh, checking out Twitch or his channel. And he releases videos sometimes of RF4 How to Catch Fish on YouTube. You have to relearn this game. Yeah. Uh, Fabio, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the family. I hope you enjoy your stay here. I hope uh, you're enjoying the entertainment. R Romario, DT saying goodbye to Gus. Gus is leaving. Or he's left. <laughs> it's been three years. Ooh. Yeah, you definitely need... <laughs> to uh, refresh your memory. Uh, bite rate not as good as I'm hoping. Unless Romario just wants DT gone. Is, is, is that what you want, Romario? Huh? <laughs> hey, right at the end. 1.1 kg mackerel. Wow. I mean, is it possible to get a trophy on this setup? We already have a trophy mackerel. Oh, it's just under two years. Okay. <laughs> sure, Romario. Sure. 
<laughs> uh, what do we need? From 300 gram garbage, it's just under two years. So I think we are catching one fish a minute. Uh, majority of the fish are non-markers, which I'm fine with. The game was released in 2021. Wait, what? It was in early access, I think, for since 2019, I think. Because I started playing this game in 2020, and I've been streaming since. I think in the morning what we can do is um, we'll still stay here, but we'll switch it out. We can try floral pilk. I don't know which one to try. Green and yellow. Not sure. Yeah, so it was an early access since 2019 and I think in 2021 they released the game. It's no longer in early access or something like that. Ooh. Go ahead and make a seat. You're ninety five percent marine now. Damn, nice work. Damn it, too small. Still no level up. That's sad. Error, try again. For what? This chat is, is error message for the chat. Darn YouTube. I think it's the app uh, that's messing up. Yeah, the app is trash. I get so many error messages for the chat as well. And it's ever since 2020, this has been happening. So they never bothered. They haven't bothered doing anything about it. Uh, let's try two green shrimps and one pink. Greeny shrimpy.
to get back to modeling again. It's been a couple of weeks. I am level 40, 40. If you look at the bottom right, uh, left of the screen. Stop playing at 27. Okay, okay. It's not too bad. Uh, guys, I am going to AFK for just two minutes. I will be right back and by then it'll be morning so we can actually do proper fishing.
I am back and that's the smallest fish ever waiting for us. It's a tiny little sardine. Alright, let's, uh, let's check this out. Currently 42 and still going strong. Two third of 43, wait, what? Oh, level 42, damn. Started playing in 2018, a year after starting Fishing Plan, according to my Fishing for pitch I posted in 2018 August. Wow. I think you started playing it when it just came out. Damn, fish right off the bat. I like it. But it takes forever <laughs> to bring it in. That's the issue. Man, this is a tiny fish. Four point six kg haddock. Okay, haddocks are pretty worthless, right? Uh, no, you cannot dig for worms when you're on a boat. Oh, <laughs> yes, yes, of course you can. You need the shovel, but yeah, once you have the shovel, you can. Okay, I'm happy we're getting, as soon as it gets down to 75 meters, we get a bite. So that's good. But because it takes so long to reel up, we need the fish quality to be good. Seven point four kg sate or kai. Anyone having a look at another spot? Another interesting spot. I kinda wanna go to the thirty four meter because you know it's very quick. Once you hook into a fish. Maybe we can spend a little bit there. Uh, at the end of the stream, maybe like half hour. You're using squid. Ooh. Hope you got something good. Mm. 
Man, this is a really good bite rate. You learned one thing when you restarted the game. <laughs> what did you learn? <laughs> God damn it. I hate cod. The average size of cod is 5.8, 5.6, 5.9 kg. Because even last time, I've been getting 5 point whatever cods. And they're absolutely worthless. These darn devs and their stupid nerfs. So frustrating. Please hit that like, please subscribe. Help us achieve our monthly goal. Really appreciate it. Comp? Uh, comp for what? All the fish you get are random, so like I... I don't see what I can... Do. Stir some old tackle in the tents, yes. You got rid of all your low levels. <laughs> yeah, premium is stupid. Stupid expensive. Yeah, going back to the little. All right, we got a tiny fish here. I'm not fishing uh, with the the small setup anymore. I'm doing pilking now before I was using uh, the other setup where this one where I was getting max but not anymore. Yeah, it's all good. So now it's just a random bunch of fish. Hopefully we get something that's worth a lot of money. Hopefully. Yeah, I remember enjoying Oldberg so much because there's so many different types of fish and um, when I was low level, it's just such an amazing map. Doggo, it's small though. Anyone know a good spot for a halibut? Hello, Danny.
He went back for carps. Yeah, that's really cool. You got the trophy pike. At least we don't have a shrimp on, so it's actually sinking at a decent rate. <laughs> thousand XP over a thousand XP bleak. Wow. Come on, fish. I think we should go to the 34 meter hole. Ah, this is taking too long. Yeah, I did fire stream of Fisher Online. Yeah, that's a lot of fun. It's a huge game. There's a lot of exploring to do, so. Do you do store quests? If I see something that's doable, yeah, I do. Let's try 34. We're going to start with pickling, and then if that's not working, we'll switch to the foam fish. And go from there. <laughs> yes, I'm pickling the fish. Ew, that is gross. Damn, that is some serious fishing jack.
You. You. <laughs> You're on your way to bed already. <laughs> Noise. Ah, fishing is okay. It's just taking too long in the 75 meter hole to pull the fish out, so I just came to the 34. Nope, no increase so far, sadly. Oh, you just woke up. Bro, I woke up at 7.40. I couldn't... I woke... My eye opened a little too early today, and I couldn't fall back asleep so right now i'm feeling so sleepy and it's like early afternoon right now <sighs> but it's also because the sea is super boring and the buy rate's a little slow so i'm just feeling so sleepy you fell asleep at sunrise damn All right, Rasmus, thank you so much for hanging out with us. All the best on your first day of work after so long, and uh, hopefully see you soon enough. Bye, Rasmus. Have a great rest. Pan, hello, welcome, welcome, how's it going? Fishy, fishy, where are you? Twenty nine point nine kg beagle at the two fifteen meter hole, huh? Damn, not bad, not bad. Oh, boo! Stupid fish got away. <laughs> if someone's willing to uh, gift me a VR. Uh, then sure, yeah. <laughs> I'd love to, uh, wake up that way. There's a lurker with natural shrimp. Fishing would be really cool. Alright, let's try the lurker. We don't have natural shrimp we can try. Uh, hunter, lurker, which lurker? A lurker 100. Oh, poop. Come on, really, bro? Gonna do me like that? Uh, what color, though? Blue? Real fishing, which is a VR game. What kind of attractants, Danny? Or what color? Blue ones? 
Wow, I actually used blue. Okay, thanks. Hope it works. Not looking too good. We will try one more time. A hey, point one percent. Finally, we will try one more time. If it takes too long, then I'll switch over to the foam fish. Ooh, lunchtime. You have a very late lunchtime. Oh wait, it's only one thirty-five for you, which is still late, but not too late. Jig step, huh? You woke up late as well. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Makes sense. Catching Marlin. Yeah, for most people, because they're from the Europe area, it's going to be evening time right now. For those of us who are in Canada and U.S., it's it's early afternoon. Night time. sucks it doesn't work so once we do get a get a fish i'm gonna switch over to the foam and uh hope that it works you have tuna on what oh you hooked into a tuna Forty five point seven KG noise. <laughs> your trap pad was well you're using the hunter 1000 i think right at the 215 meter hole Ooh, 55 with the m at 25 or oh, 600 gram can't use that it's too heavy for my rod Ooh, look at that quick bite I hope this is a sign. Oh, 
Oh damn. Giant Chad, never mind. <laughs> Level 85. on no even this isn't working garbage Jig steps, too much work. So I don't ever bother with it. <laughs> okay, maybe red color is the answer. Yeah. Yeah, I'm using red right now as, as long as we can keep getting fish. Okay, if we can keep getting eel pouts, that would be super awesome sauce. I'm coming.
Come on, game. What's going on here? See, this sucks. Like, all of a sudden, we get three fish and then nothing. It's always been this way for me at the sea. Damn, okay. The eels are here, but first tab with 35 kg. Uh, Yoj, hello, welcome, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for all the likes, guys. 23, 24 likes. That is neat. How cool? What do you mean? Three point five kg place. Damn, fish by well. Uh, no, it's slow. It's slow. I don't know what's working, what's not. Salty fish. Which fish? Tiny fish. Maggot provoker. Quicker. Tiny fish, try tiny fish.
No, I have 67.7%. Okay, tiny fish giving us a tiny fish. Ooh, is this an eel powder again? I hope so. Spiny doggo, okay, 1.3. Oh yeah, thank you. Yeah, I cannot wait for 75%. Uh, then we can finally enjoy the sea. Right now it's a struggle. Not good. It's 75 and above, very good. Okay, this must be an eel pal. No, it is a stupid sculpin. <laughs> Okay, okay. Hopefully this continues, this bite rate. Uh, today you bought Imperial Reel, wow. Swordfish 70 kg, Greenland Shark 80 kg. Wow. Easy money and very quick. Uh, your skill level 3 looks like beginners, 34 points that wasn't used. That's perfect. Once you remember everything and you know what you want to go into or specialize in, then you can start spending your points. We're downloading percent. You got triumph in the last rod, but I don't catch anything. Oh, <laughs> you have the opposite problem. With DV, hi, welcome. Welcome to the stream. Uh, fishing is okay. It's all over the place. Can't really tell if it's good fishing or bad fishing. I feel it's okay fishing. We're just trying to figure out what works here in the 34 meter hole. Thirteen kg. If you haven't already, guys, please like, please subscribe, help us achieve our monthly goal of the month. Ten likes. I have to go taking care of everyone. Thank you so much for hanging out with us, DT Gaming. Have a great rest of your Sunday, and uh, take care of yourself as well. See you soon, hopefully. Bye. Yeah, look at that. Okay, we're doing good now. Man, I just need more eel pouts. Yeah, well, you have that knowledge, that's perfect, and that option.
If you need money, go to higher levels, make quick buck, and then come back. Five point six. See, yeah, they just nerfed it so hard. It's it's so annoying. Five point six. Five point eight. Five point nine. Yeah, it would take way too long to grind it back. Yeah, relearn the controls. 6kg, look! They really did <laughs> make sure you only get 5 to 6kg. Sparks! Hi, welcome to the stream. What's up? Hope you're doing well. Eel pout, yay! One, two, three, four eel pouts. Doing good. I'm doing good as well. Thank you for asking. I mean, they didn't nerf cod size only its price a lot. Are you sure? Uh, I think they changed. Yeah, I think. Uh, they, yeah, they didn't touch the size. They increased the population and nerfed its uh, its value to the ground. Okay, okay, okay. But like in the past, I never had such a consistent size of CODs. I guess since they're more frequent, we're finally getting to know what really is their normal size. 1 kg on the dot. Now I have to catch a bigger bleak. <laughs> 1000 plus XP bleak. Bleakosaurus. Wow, that is a stupid, stupidly severe uh, nerf from 800 to 5 to 600. That is, ouch. That bothers me. 2.4 kg Pollock. It's been a while since I've seen you, Pollock. But I guess the tiny fish is the winner here at the 34. Uh, it's, it's working for us. 6 minutes, 8 markers. We started, I don't know, 12. I don't know where we started, this Pollock or the Eel Pout. It was 1.0, oh, 1.1 K XP. Did you need the screenshot? Your last new trophy was a Pollock. Nice. I don't have a Pollock yet.
Oh, you're targeting it? Perfect. Haddock. Haddock. I think I have a Haddock trophy, right? Yeah, I do have a Haddock trophy. See, take. Yep, leaders, leaderboards just reset. Oh, uh, bycatch. Give me fishy. It is night time, so it is going to be slow. So we might not get another fish until morning. 3, 4 a.m. Please be eel pout. Damn, this thing. You know what would be really cool? If we get an eel power trophy at night. Wow, you got the trophy on black foam, that's cool. Uh, professional fishing too, I noticed when you're not doing a task, fish catch is random. But when you're doing a cast, they seem to be timed. So is it worse when you're doing a quest or is it worse when you're not doing a quest? Yep. He was doing one bleak in one hour and I didn't catch one until the last five minutes. <laughs> Oof. Fourth 9k caught in 12 minutes. What? You're making bank. <laughs> uh.
here. Fishy, fishy, fishy. We still gotta wait till at least 4 a.m. before we can start getting bites. It's almost three, we're in the middle. We have like 20 minutes, 25 minutes left in the rental. Eel pout, eel pout, please. If it's going to be this tiny. Oh man, a non marker. Why, doggo? Why? Look like a cheap shark. <laughs> yeah, it looks like a speed bump to me. Or a speed breaker or a speed hump. Whatever you call it in your in your country. That's what it looks like. Damn it, 500 gram cod. Stop it, cod, stop it. Oh, you know the find the <laughs> in the gift shop <laughs> like that. Okay, okay, that's funny. And Greenland is Greenland is an old shark. 
Uh, it is a very old looking shark. Rubber toys, squeaky toys. Gram. Eel pout, eel pout, eel pout, come on. Damn it. The yeah, fish quality has gone down. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh-oh, what's happening? Stop being so annoying.
maybe it's time to change the lure because the bite has gotten has dropped Whiny fish, huh? Ah, <sighs> provoker, real worm. Kind of want to try this. We got like nine minutes left, maybe ten. Place one point five okay. Just caught 139 kg halibut, thought it was a trophy. Ooh, is 150 kg a trophy? I thought it was 100 kg. Oh, that sucks. Hey, you're going after halibuts and uh, look, you got a 139 kg. You're almost there. Okay, 150 is a trophy size. Okay. Well, I hope the trophy is in reach. Yo, gabba gabba. I won barely trophy, 150 kg, perfect. 2.1k silver, that is good money. Damn. Thank you. 
So the buy rate on this is small, uh, slow, sorry, but we've got two plays in a row. And this is hopefully another place, a small one. Look at that, another place. Can we get another one? Is this a place worm? Inventory tells you your level. What does the star mean? Mine says level 27 star 10. So level 40, 60 hair, 62 I have is how many different types of trophies you have. How many different species of trophies you have. Whereas here trophy caught 339. Um, probably a hundred of those trophies were uh like uh, crucian carp trophies right but here it tells you how many different species of fish you've got trophies of if that made sense Too bad, not silver. Only played the game for a month or so. Wow, and you made it to like level what twenty seven? <laughs> you played, you played serious. Jovin, hi, welcome. Okay, I got a minute left. Man, that's garbage. Come on. <sighs> I don't know how many non-marker cards we've got. Uh, but the worst thing is even if I'm getting non-marker fish, that's fine as long as you're still giving me like, you know, points. Yeah, almost $10 for five coins. That's so expensive. You know, here, um, I thought this was in Canadian dollars. Three days for $3.50, but it's a scam. It's in American dollars. So this is $3.50 American for three days, which is so bullcrap. I'm doing good, Joven. How about you? Thank you for asking. Nice, nice. Very good fishing trip you had. I'm happy to hear that. That's pretty cool. You were on a fly fishing trip? Wow, all those chubs on fly fishing. That's so cool.
All right. Why can you buy an equipment for five coins? Yeah, just the lures and baits and that's it. Nothing else. And boat tickets. Three day, three hour rental is one gold coin. Are you kidding me? Wow, that's stupid. And maybe Norway you can buy? Oh, you can't. That's very expensive. Never mind. Alright, yay! We have enough 116 silver. Uh, poop. That's, that's all we have. Yep, 116 silver. So six, seven hundred silver minus two hundred seven six five hundred. So we made two hundred fifty silver per hour, which is honestly not bad because initially it was very slow. At the eighty, uh, uh, what is it, fifty five meter hole, and then we did uh, the small fishing, right? So we weren't really making much money because we were there for XP. But then once we came to the 34 meter hole is where we started making money i'm trying to remember when we moved i think this haddock yeah i think this haddock was our first fish 52 minutes ago one hour ago yeah i think this is our first fish so we made 331 silver in 52 minutes uh so not too bad <sighs> Okie dokie. Well, I hope you enjoyed the stream. You know what? Russian sturgeon fishing was amazing today. So I'm so glad that worked out for us. Um, 34 meter hole is really annoying because you need to keep switching lures and see what's working. And something, one of the, like some of the lures do work and you'll get like really nice fish for five minutes and then it dies out. And then you got to explore again which lure works. And that's just annoying to me. So, uh, thank you so much for hanging out with me, guys. I hope to see you soon enough. Please tune back to the channel tomorrow. I have a video releasing tomorrow of a fishing game. So, you think anyone bought the 2000 lifetime premium for this? Oh, a lot of people. A lot of people. There are so many whales in this game. That's the reason why everything is so overpriced because people are gobbling down at these expensive prices so thank you so much for hanging out with me guys romantic venomous jack joven everyone else bye guys <laughs>